Tell us a little bit about yourself and where you are from. Um, I'm from um, El Paso originally. Um, I was born in, in Mexico, across the border from El Paso in Ciudad Juarez, Chihuahua. Um, I graduated from the Valle High School, class of 2011. And after that, well, I, I'm here. How was the preseason this year for the team? Our preseason started a little bit earlier than, than the usual. Doing different stuff, pool sessions, um, cycling sessions, and, and a lot of hard work into, into our preseason. Tell us, what are you studying and what are your plans after you graduate? I'm majoring in Spanish and I have a minor in kinesiology. Um, my, my plans are to, to teach Spanish and, and coach soccer. But, but as for now, I want to keep focusing on, on my, my soccer. I want to keep playing after I graduate in December, try to find uh, a professional team, professional tryout. Um, if it's not in God's hands, then, then just stick with teaching and coaching. You are a defender and you're also an attacker. What do you see as your role on the team this year? As a defender, it's a, it's a primary role of obviously defend, right? Um, but when I first got here, I was, um, I was not considered a defender. I've never played defender um, before I got here. And, and my, my first two, three years here, it was a learning experience for me um, to play, to play a, as a left back. Um, and honestly, my, my teammates, the coach, sometimes they, they have to scream at me, they have to yell at me because I am uh, offensive mentality, you know, and, and I like to get forward, I like to attack at the same time, um, which from my side, I believe it's, it's a, it could be a good thing, but it could turn to a bad and negative thing, you know, um, but I believe it's, it's been a good learning experience to, um, to, to get that defensive, defensive role. Jonathan, tell us, what does it feel like to be nominated this week's Male Player of the Week? The most, the most I could say is it's thanks to the team. Thanks to the team effort, thanks to, to the hard work that we've been putting in. And, and as I've been talking to them, I tell them, hey, hard work pays off, you know. Um, but at the same time, it's, it's, if it was not because of them, I would have not get even close to, to getting nominated Player of the Week.